What's going on everyone, Meta Raymond here, and welcome back to episode number 59 of the group arm and almost at the big 6-0. Today we're going to do a shitload of TOB, and we're gonna see a very, very rare drop. You'll have to see for yourself, I'm not gonna spoil this, this whole shit blank right at the intro. We're getting a lot of different drops, we're unlocking something from the uh, boss points collection, if you guys remember from the last episode we were saving up for something. We are unlocking that today, and a lot more other things incoming as well. But first, we have a very juicy giveaway on this particular video. Two times $25 for two different winners. If you want to enter that giveaway, all you need to do is, of course, subscribe to the channel, like this video, come during the game down below, and turn on the post notifications. You've done all of that, you entered the giveaway. I wish you all the best of luck on that. If you're new to Runex, make sure you use the link at the top of the description to create an account. And of course, make sure you join the Runex Discord and my own private Discord. Links for that in the description down below as well. With that being said, I really hope you guys enjoyed this episode and let's jump right into it. <laughs> Didn't realize this earlier, but we got Raid Champion for 10 expert raids completed. Can't wait for this one though, this is the, the big boy. 10 Masters and then 10 Grandmasters one day in the future, but this is nice. Not a little, oh, Ring of Wealth Eye, that's... Uh, interesting. What to do, what to do. I know I should do more Sire, but I also really don't want to do more Sire, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I think I just have to uh, get over it and get back on that grind. I want crests. Alright, did a little normal TOB with the boys. Uh, let's see if it pays off or not. I'm gonna check the MVP score real quick. Yeah, of course, Mr. Scythe is always on top now. Can't beat a side no matter what I do. No rare for me, unfortunately, but 17 minutes, I'll take that. That's a decent rate time. And another normal TOB completed. Just wanted to do two before I had to cook dinner. No MVP, of course, because sleep is still here. Good luck, nothing. Okay, five bags of riches, some prayer renewals, and battle mage potions. Anyone else, though? You never know. Might be normies, but... There's always that option. I mean, my first two raids, raid items were from normals after all. Oh, dude got an infernal elixir. Very nice. Definitely gonna save mine for masters. Man, I do have to say, I'm very, very satisfied with my TOB results so far. 68 KC, insanely low still for a Sanguinesti staff that just this year chest guard, the Sanguinesti pendant. And three different crest pieces, like bro, Grazi Rapier would be a significant upgrade over the Dragon Hunter Lance for now, at least for a little bit. I feel like it's gonna be better, like a lot more accurate, faster. Fursic Book, obviously a big upgrade as well. Just this here piece is no need. A Fernic Defender would be would be great, like a massive upgrade over the Dragon Defender T. And yeah, just so much more to go. Even an Epic Pet Box, I would gladly take Xenai Chart. Why not? Like, we'll just keep going until we get the Scythe eventually, and we're now getting dangerously close to Masters, and that's really the point I want to get to, because streaming Master TOB is going to be so much fun. The only painful part is that once you unlock Masters, it's 850 rates to go until you finally get to Grand Masters. Wait, I I'm just standing here, I know some people are raiding, and I just noticed Mister got his second Sanguine S Dependent. Nine raids later, after that first one, what the fuck? That's actually insane. Alright, here we go with another normal TOB this time around. Oops, got hit. Quite hard right there. Just a little normal one. Expert was full. Let's see what we get. Anything? Nah. Unlucky. Wait, what? My man just got a fucking Scythe 1KC. Wait, what? Wait, what? He, but he just got a fucking scythe after I left. Wait, what? I'm pr Bro, he got a scythe! Fucking 1kc! Oh my fucking god. That isn't- that wasn't my raid, dude. He was with us. What the flying fuck. Alright, this time an expert TOB. If there's another scythe, please let it be mine. I think it's my turn, man. It's been long enough since that pendant. Even he got a second pendant. Nothing. Oh, your porter received the 5%. I haven't seen that in a long time. 
Thousand purple sweets is pretty nice though. Alright, here we go with another expert raid. Good luck boys. 8.4k points this time around, a bit less. Sleep with 13k and we get nothing. Two epic bonus chests. Woohoo. Anyone else? Doesn't seem that way. Come on, open the chest faster, boys. Nothing, nothing. Alright, I guess it's nothing. Another very scuffed raid with a lot of deaths and shit. It was just fucking awful. Mm, garbage. 23 minutes. Ugh. Sack of riches, master tag, elixir. Nothing for sleep. Mr. Got nothing. And Novus gets a Zenite shard. Actually, that's a massive grats because it's not a raid item. Ha! <laughs> And one more expert raid to end of the night. GL. Oh damn, I'm MVP by far this time. For nothing! Yay! Awesome, thank you game. Well, at least we completed our daily in a 28 minute raid. God, that's fucking awful. No rares for anyone apparently. Shame. On the bright side of things, it was our double daily and we get some chests and sacks from raids themselves. That's a lot of chests. Give me those runex points. Okay. And decent 30k runex. 25k blood money and some taco for rune coins. I'll take that. Is there anything else? I think it's just price chests, right? Yeah. Plus my double, so that's nice. Oh, my rune coin also reset apparently. I don't have the items for that at the moment. Well then. Unfortunately, we didn't get a rare today, but better luck next time. Oh yeah, and we are at uh, 7400 boss points now. 100 more to go. Alright, we decided to... I have to be a bit quiet. We decided to uh, continue with the TOB grind either way. We really need that KC up. I want to stream Masters in next week, man. We're currently at uh, 114. About to be 115. No rare, that's okay, 18 minute raid, that is much more like it. And yeah, like one or two more raids and I should have my uh, boss points up there. Imagine having to teleport out at Fursic, because of fucking E-Corp spawns. Oh, such a big fucking rip, dude, not gonna lie, but... E-Corp is just too rare to leave it for one raid, like we can do another raid after the E-Corp, it's not that big of a deal, but... Still sucks to just waste it like that, you're literally teleporting out at Fursic 15 minutes of your time gone, or at least 10 minutes. You know, and it, it, there's always that, that leftover feeling of, oh yeah, that would have been the scythe, you know what I mean? Like, oh yeah, that one. Obviously very unlikely, but you get the idea. I should have had a Ring of Wealth on half time. Oh. We got five shards, that's actually pretty fucking good. I'll take that gladly. A lot of different uh, raids later. We are now 12 boss points off of God Wars Dungeon. So I'm gonna just go ahead and do a little bit of Sire and get that out of the way. All right, here we fucking go, boys. 7,500 boss points. Oh man, this has been a journey, all right. I wanna test it out instantly, not gonna lie. Superior God Wars Dungeon 1. One in a thousand spawn chance unlocked. Beautiful. Alright guys, we just managed to get a prize key from a fortune accessory. That might be a first actually. Don't know if I've ever had that before, but that's very, very nice. Yeah, I'll gladly take one of those. Currently at 843 boss points, we have killed... About 400 Kreel Tutorov so far, a lot in VIP, and now just inside of here because I'm running low on VIP tickets and I can't waste them like that anymore. My boy Appa making hella progress with a Solar Demon pet for example, he also got a prize key himself, another little room coin bag, might have to actually go hard on some room coin exchanges here, otherwise we might not have enough, or even close to it, I have enough for one enchant. I have three chests. Ooh, this is gonna be edgy. I don't know if I have enough for this. I definitely don't see enough rune coin items to get a significant amount out of it. Not worth using a gem on at the very least. You know, I, I don't want to use a uh, gem unless it's 15k rune coins inside of the machine at the very, very least. 
We have two fucking keys, man. I wanna open them. But what can I do? I'm gonna just get rid of the AGS on. Nah, no, I don't want to. <laughs> Contradictions. Let's just check that out first. Is it over 2.5k? Oh, not even. Son of a bitch. Can we just... Okay, you know what? Let's just do one first and hopefully it's successful. Which it is, so we can open that with the first key. And maybe... This will give enough. Elemental Blessing. What the fuck does an Elemental Blessing do again? Infinite runes? Yeah, infinite elemental runes, right? Yeah, okay. That's actually a pretty interesting item. That's such a shame, why doesn't it give magic damage? That is a little saddening, not gonna lie. Karasi chaps are decent. I don't think I'm gonna keep that, you know. Ah, tough. It is tough. Because sometimes I want to use my Tormented Bracelet, or even a Tormented Bracelet or for 7.5%, 5%. Or I have to use my Elemental Runecrafting Gloves, which are 2.5%. So I would sacrifice my Efficiency Blessing for a bonus in that one. Just this gift, can't do this one apparently. And I can't do Dragon change, uh, Chains. At least enough for one more chest and chant. Can we please get 2 out of 2? I really need that. Yes! Oh, thank you! Hashtag blessed. And we get a blowpipe! Um, that is interesting. I mean, straight to Brune coins, obviously. But not bad at all. Blue Halloween is kinda shit. Crystal keys are unnecessary for us as well. But, um, yeah, I'm saving up some good items for another 15k with a gem. So we get a chunky amount of Brune coins the next time we go for a big exchange. I feel like I should have waited for my daily to reset in five hours. Oh well, not a biggie. Alright, nice little solo TOB. Normal difficulty completed. 19.9k points, not bad at all. Probably nothing, because it's always nothing on normals for me, but... Ah, that's not true, but ah, well, whatever. It is a uh, useless mod with some bolts and a master task bottle. 32 minutes solo. Eh? A lot of room for improvement. And another normal TOB raid with the boys. Ooh, nothing. Price chest, not bad. Not bad. 19 minutes, I like that. And another normal TOB. Any rares for the boys? Come on. I think I might be MVP again. Yeah, quite a bit actually. Good luck. Nothing for them. Oh, I thought it was a rare for a second. Nothing for intermediate. Yeah, nothing, nothing, nothing. 